Hey YouTube, it's your girl right here. I'm back again. Hey fam, how y'all doing? This time I'm back with a review on this uh, product I saw reviewed. Uh, Love Kisses 99. I ordered it. As I always do, I keep saying I'm going to stop doing that. But yeah, I did it again. But I had to try this. This face putty. Because I got all these craters and, you know, deep spots from old um, blemishes and stuff in my face. So I want to try it. It's supposed to be good. I haven't tried all other primers. Why not? You know? I like it. <laughs> Need to say, I do like it. It comes like this, just in a regular box, but it's inside of these. And it contains two little containers. One is the moisturizer. And this is the moisturizer. And this one is the um, primer. So you got the moisturizer, the primer and the moisturizer. On a clean, washed face, of course. Because I got oil. That's why I say clean. You have to wash all the oil off first. And then you apply the moisturizer. And right after the moisturizer, you know, I gave mine a minute to get mattified. And then I applied the... Uh, primer and then I move forward with my makeup. You'll see that in the video because along with reviewing the face putty because you couldn't really see it. I had to find something additional to do to do along with this review because I've had this a couple of days. So I picked up two um, foundations that I hadn't tried. I went to Walgreens today and I picked up the True Match Lumi and when I got home, it looks a little dark. Yeah, I'm going to have to fix this lighting. Because to me, it don't look good. When I play this back, I get it. But to me, it just doesn't look right. So anyway, the Lumi first. I think this was like 13 bucks. I think it was $13. And then I picked up this uh, True, Blend, True Blend Foundation in D6. So, stay tuned. Here's the video coming up next. Bye. Okay, y'all, we're going to start with the face putty. The first one we're going to use is the uh, moisturizer. Which I know we really can't see this, but I'm hoping the effects will show. I'll just put a couple of pumps on there. Probably didn't need but one, but I always overdo some. I already washed my face with my um, witch hazel wash. That's the moisturizer. It's got a minty feel to it. It feels like cool mint. Feels good. Okay, after applying the moisturizer, we apply the face primer. Yeah. I'm just going to use one pump of that. First time using, I guess I gotta pump it up first. Yeah, one pump of that. Same minty feeling, minty tingly. got that in now we can move on with the true blend foundation this is in D6 toasted almond I'll put a couple of pumps well I guess I gotta unlock it first y'all <laughs> oh that might be too dark I might have got both of them too dark. Shoot. I'm going to put a little bit on this stipple brush. And let's see. Let me come in and see how I can get a better look on how I cover these spots and dots. Mm 
Okay. On this first coat, it ain't doing nothing for these spots and dots. It feels good on my face. But like I said, it ain't doing nothing for these spots and dots. I'm going to go in for round two. I don't know how good this lighting is, y'all, but I hope it's it's okay. I've been playing with it for a minute before I started this video. I like that face putty. I really do. Like I said, you can't see it. Only the results of the foundation wear will tell. So I will keep you guys posted. Let me zoom out some. I'm gonna zoom in some more. Yeah, it covered them spots and dots pretty good, y'all. Yeah. Oh, I got a little bit too orange. Like I said, I won't know the quality of this video until I sit down and start to download it. To me, I look really orange right now. And I didn't want to turn off any more light because it looks like the video gets too dark when I do that. Okay, that's it. That's my review on this D6 foundation and uh, the face putty primers. Y'all let me know what you think. And I hope the quality of the video doesn't affect what we can see. But I like it. It's real light. It seems like it's almost turning into powder and that's weird for a liquid foundation. Okay, maybe I can see my completed look in the next video. All right, <laughs> bye. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, I must say, I must say, I truly like this face primer. It feels like I have nothing on my face, face, and it's real peppermint. -y. And this foundation is a yes, a must for me. I'm saying it now. Mind you, I haven't tried it wearing it 12 hours through a 12 hour work shift or tried it all day. I just did this tonight so I could get this uh, video up. I absolutely have nowhere to go other than the bed. But as the the look and feel of it and the coverage, I like. But I, I am going to say I'm going to continue to use my um, tinted moisturizer. I don't know if that's good because I like the face putty moisturizer and the face putty primer. But I'm going to be putting this on top of it just because I got so many spots and dots. And then my moisturizer. Probably why I need so much skincare stuff too because I'm putting all this crap on my face. But... When you got all these spots and dots and this oily skin, you'll see why. And I hate this wig. If y'all wonder, we can talk about it if you want to know, but I don't like it. Okay. All right. Bye, y'all. <laughs>